All right, we've got 0x pattern 204, and uh, I just set it up, and it's a last pocket puzzle. Nothing is near the 8-ball, so immediately I started to think how I could put something over there. This 14, bump the 12 over, is the best candidate. Then to run out, I see a, uh, a nice little pattern here. As crazy as this sounds, I'm thinking, shoot the 15, the 12, uh, 14 to bump the 12 over, then I can shoot the 13. I can roll down, shoot the 11, that's connected to this 10, 11 to, I'm sorry, 11 to the 9, that's connected to the 10, and then the 10 will get me to the 12 ball. So, again, what I'm seeing here is 15 stop, shoot the 14, bump the 12 out, 13, just roll it down, 11, back up a little for the 9, 9 to the 10, and then the 12 gets me out. So that's what I'm going to try. So that's the first thing that I saw, and here we go. So if I stop right there, I should be great on this uh, 14 to bump the 12 over. So this is just a straight uh, stop shot, 6 o'clock on the cue face. And now I'm going to shoot the 14 with a little bottom right, like 6 or 5.30 on the cue face, just enough to bump the 12 over, hit it in the face. That looks great. So now, I think the rest of the pattern is pretty simple. I'm going to roll this up for a shot on the 11 ball in that corner. Now I've got a nice little stop shot or a draw, barely a draw shot for the 9. Bottom right. And a little bit of a misfire there, but that's okay. I'll shoot the 9 all the way up for the 10. And I crossed over the 10, but it's still going to work out. I'd have liked to hit it differently, but what are you going to do? First try, no warm up. And now I can shoot the 12 to the 8. All right. I may try to clean it up, but that's the pattern that I saw right off the bat.